Hi, I'm Greg Schaefer. Welcome to the Virtual CISO Moment. Security is a lot like anything physical. You just have to work at it in order to become better at it. We never have a time in information security where we reach that point where we're, we're completely secure. Now, some folks might think that compliance is sort of around that that area, but that's not really the case. Because compliance is a snapshot in time. Uh, just, just like going to the gym doesn't make you an athlete, you actually have to do stuff. Uh, becoming compliant doesn't make you secure. And just going to the gym and doing stuff doesn't mean that you stay in shape forever. You have to continuously be working at it over and over and over. And that's the same thing with security because environments change, people change, the threat elements out in the area change, and so we've got to be continuously vigilant about what it is that we're doing and how we're doing it. And if you don't do it right, just like in the gym, if you're not prepared, you can get hurt, you've got to use the right tools for the right job, and you've got to know your limits. You've got to understand what's a threat and what isn't, because if you don't understand your limits and you don't respect the threats that you can have for either working out or in security, well then bad things are what usually ends up happening. So what does that all mean? What, what do you need to do? Well, regular exercise is what keeps people in shape. It's what keeps people healthy and able to do the job that they need to do. You have to exercise your security program, your security controls the same way. You can't expect to just be done with it, take one class in spinning, for example, and then you're a uh, cyclist uh, uh, ready to go on the Tour de France, you have to continuously work, work, and work at it. And sometimes, even with all that work, things happen. You can be as prepared as, as anything right now. Uh, in fact, I'm nursing a little bit of an arm elbow type injury. Uh, really, there wasn't too much I could have done to prevent it. I just was uh, at a point where it needed to take a rest. Uh, I needed to lay off of it a little bit. Uh, sometimes things happen with information security controls. They become a little lax. People get caught up with a phishing email. It doesn't necessarily mean that the controls are bad. It does point to the fact, though, that even under the best of intentions and best circumstances, you can also have a breach or you can also have an injury. So, really, my advice for you from the gym uh, with regards to the parallels between the, uh, the uh, physical uh, fitness and your information security fitness is, think about the two parallels. How often do you exercise your controls in your program? Are you testing the controls that you have in place? Do you do business continuity tabletop exercises? Um, are, you, are you making sure that all of your defensors are strong? Are you keeping them fed? Are you keeping them exercised? Because ultimately, you want to make sure that your information security program is in the best shape in order to counter all the threats out there.